it's very hard to kind of open up this video and talk about everything that has kind of gone on quite recently. And if you didn't know, Jason David Frank, who played Tommy Oliver, the Green Ranger, multiple Power Ranger series, has now passed on due to suicide. Now, rather than jumping straight in and talking about this, in the description as well as the comments, I am going to be putting suicide prevention uh, prevention hotlines, I think that's what they're called, but basically phone numbers that you can call if you are feeling like like this, you, you want to talk to someone. I highly recommend that you check them out and talk to someone. If you don't want to talk to them, then talk to a friend, family member, someone. Make sure that you reach out to someone so that you can talk to them and you know, just talk. That that's the that's the main thing. Now with Jason David Frank, with him committing suicide and it's still hard to kind of think of because I imagine that he would pop on Instagram Live or Facebook Live or announce a convention or whatever and talk about his project, Legend of the White Dragon, you know, doing really, really big things and, and talking about it. And it's still kind of weird to kind of see that he has passed away. And I, I, just, I don't know how to process it at the moment. Um, I unfortunately don't have very good memories of uh, when I've met him. I, I don't know how to really kind of uh, talk about this and and kind of process, but I know how much JDF meant to other people. I will give him credit for the time that I, I've, I've known about him and I've not got fond memories. I respect him. You know, some of the stuff he's done in the past, I didn't agree with, um, but... You know, I respect the shit out of him because, you know, for he was there promoting his stuff. He was there to uh, talk to fans to kind of really like do it. I like the the fact that he did the Last Man Standing. I feel that that was the one thing to to kind of give to fans. Um, I know he did something else, which I'll talk about in a second. But the fact is that at Palmorphka or any convention really, that he would stay there till the last person so he could sign. And I like the fact that he actually spoke to the fans, like rather than just be the generic sign and, and go, he would speak to people. And that was much later on in, in the convention circuit and stuff like that. The fact is that when uh, COVID hit and he started to do his version of like, hey, just invite me to the convention, uh, the whole place is, or the comic book shop is going to keep the the money he just wants to meet fans and that to me was generous like it's something that you don't normally see right now this morning when i found out um i i woke up early in the morning and that was the first thing that i saw that people were talking about this they were saying stuff like um he's passed he's 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 not longer here and i feel like with the way that the world works right now is that anyone can put up a post and say, this person has gone and people believe in it. And that's something that I don't believe in right there. So I took a while to kind of look around before saying anything. I've obviously finished work and then obviously reading the article TMZ, which we're going to have a look at in a minute. Um, yeah, it, it's it's really, it, it's not sunk in. I don't know if I've mentioned, but I feel like he's just going to pop up and say, hey guys, Today we're going to be talking about this or, hey, guess what? I'm going to be at this Comic Con. And I think when you see what someone's going through, you don't see what they're going through. And then it's such a big shock. It, it really is. So let's, let's have a look at the, the uh, TMZ article. Power Rangers Jason David Frank uh, dead by suicide at 49. Well, so... In theory, Walter Jones, so here is an update, um, probably in America. Walter Jones, who played the Black Ranger in MMPR, tells TMZ he was an inspiration to so many people. His presence will be dearly missed. It's so sad to lose another member of the Ranger family. He adds, Jason was one of the biggest pranksters on the show. He had a wild sense of humor. Uh, we, ha we had our shares of ups and downs, but I stayed consistent uh, about being an ear if he needed one. My prayer goes out to his family and all that will miss him. Jason David Frank, one of the original Power Rangers, has died. TMZ has learned. The actor and mixed martial artist died in Texas, according to his rep, Justine Hunt. 
Uh, sources will, with direct knowledge, tell us his death was the result of suicide. JDF is known as, as Tommy Oliver from the original run of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers franchise dating back to the kids' series debut in 1993, when he was introduced as one of the six crime-fighting monster superheroes masked, with, uh, masked head-to-toe with kung fu skills. Fans will remember he started out as the Green Ranger in Season 1, introduced as the first as an enemy of the Power Rangers, only to do a 180 and become good. After his power has uh, after his powers decided to uh, detch more, however, he turned into the White Ranger and tapped as the new leader of the group. Frank st- um, starred as the one of the leads of the three seasons, totaling 123 episodes. Frank went to reprise his role as Tommy in several adaptations of Power Rangers, including Wild Force, Turbo, Zeo, Dino Thunder, Mega Force, Ninja Steel, Hyper Force, and more. He's been the Red Ranger, a Black Ranger, a Green Ranger, and you. And JDF is a fan. Uh, JDF is a fan favorite Power Ranger, which is why he returned to the franchise uh, time and time again. His on-screen fighting abilities translated into the real world. Frank was a professional trained MMA brawler who was well-versed in everything from tong, uh, taekwondo, uh, mo t- um, mu thai, mai, mai thai, sorry, judo, Brazilian jiu-jitsu, and others. He fought professionally for a time from 2008 to 2010. He's survived by his four children. Jason's rep, Justine, tells TMZ, please respect the privacy of the family members during this horrible time as we come to terms with the loss of a, such a wonderful human being. He really loved his family, friends, and fans very much. He will truly be missed. Frank was 49. R.I.P. If you know someone who is thinking of suicide, please call the National Suicide Prevention uh, Lifeline at 988. That's obviously an American one. The fact that the fact is that Jason David Frank meant so much to loads of people around the world, and you can see it in the way he was, and you can see it in the way that fans were when they loved everything part of him. I think the thing that I loved the most, I think my favorite version of Tommy was in Dino Thunder because it was just so cool. I feel like Tommy had had a complete turnaround of an entire arc and this was his final stage to say, hey, I'm a, I'm the the Power Ranger. And this is what I'm going to do. Now, obviously, favorite Green because that's who he was and that's what a lot of people would do. I think this is kind of weird knowing that Jason David Frank is no longer with us. And that's what really gets to me. Um, it's sad because just thinking about it, he was a huge role model um, in life where I wanted the Green Ranger coin for myself and I had to take it from a dragon dagger. But then realizing it wouldn't go in the power morpher because I thought it was the exact same size. And then I destroyed a dragon dagger and, just, and that's it. And I don't even have that coin anymore. Uh, but... I think that even when it came to learning karate, and I think hearing these, ah, that was the the one thing that I would do if I pretended to fight, if I pretended to do anything, yeah, was the the thing I do, and it's still a part of me because he made a, a, such an impact. Rather than ha, yeah, it was see, yeah, that was that was the main thing. Ah, uh, it, it's so weird knowing that he's no longer with us and. I don't know how to process it. Maybe earlier during the day I was absolutely fine and now thinking about it, I just feel it's it's a harsh thing. Like my my heart and you know, my thoughts go out to his family and I know that they're going through a rough time. I know the the Ranger Nation's going through a rough time as well. So again, like all I can say is if you're having these feelings, if you're having these thoughts, then please talk to someone. Don't leave it. Don't be like, oh, it'll get better. Talk to someone. If you have these thoughts, talk to them. Like talk to someone, like talk to the prevention hotline, talk to family members, just talk to someone. You know, it's yeah, it's it's a big thing that you need to talk and share emotions. And I think that we need to make aware of it for a lot more. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how to really end it. I'm gonna in a way, miss JDF. I'm hoping that the community heals over time. But right now, I know his family are going through something really bad right now. And yeah, it's 
I don't know how to end this, so I think I may just end it here.